So, I did an unboxing uh, a few days ago of this tablet, and I had some issues with the tablets. It started out with a, a blurry screen, and then it was getting slow. I couldn't get any apps to work properly, so I had to do a reset on it, a master reset to factory settings. It was fine for, like... Probably, I don't know, after I got all my apps in it and from there worked for a little while for like two hours. And then it started doing the same thing, getting kind of glitchy. And then the next thing I noticed was a blue screen from the home button up to about halfway. Um, I don't know if anybody else out there has experienced this. I've seen one video uh, of a gentleman that uh, was experiencing that and he said he sent it away. And uh, there was some internal issues with some uh, uh, hardware or something. They said they had to change out. So I didn't trust it. So I went and took it back and I got a new one. So as you can see, I'm just going to show you the, uh, the seal is not broke. Just so you'll know that I'm not lying. And... Uh, I'm going to open this up. This is a same thing, 9.6, uh, 16 gigabytes, and it's black. So if there's anybody else out there that's having the issue, um, your tablet acting funny, you notice the uh, screen, like your apps are getting kind of uh, hazy. Um, your videos, basically your, your, your screen's like cloudy. So it's hard to explain. And I uh, knew that wasn't right because as soon as I did a fax reset, it was crystal clear and it was the way it was supposed to be. So I knew there was something wrong. So uh, if I can find out what the problem is, I called Samsung. I talked to them and they were like, well, you only had the tablet for a couple of days. Take it back and get a new one. But I did a master reset uh, or actually cleared the cache in the roots, root section. And uh, I did a couple things in there and then they re rebooted it. And it came back and it looked pretty good, but uh, I didn't trust it. I didn't have to have a tablet. I didn't want a tablet that was going to give me issues a month or so down the road, and then I'm going to have to send it away and be without a tablet. And, you know, bring the tablet being tore apart is just not what I want. And uh, I'm a technician, so basically, if I'm going to tear, if there's going to be a tablet that's going to be tore apart, I'll, I'll do it myself. That way I know what's being done, done right. Uh, so. I've never experienced a blue screen like that, just going from the home button up. And that would tell me just for myself that it's not a software issue. It's got to be hardware on the inside. Either the screen's getting warm or it's uh, some kind of a, uh, where the cable ribbon cable plugs into the board up here. Uh, maybe there's a malfunction in there. It's hard to explain, but um, it definitely was not would not be a software issue, you guys. So if they try to tell you that, don't let them tell you that. Uh, they really don't care. They just make you take this, fix it, and tear your tablet all to pieces. So, yeah. So, anyway, this is a new tablet I'm going to open up. I'm not going to do an unboxing of it. Actually, I'll just open it up just so you guys can see that it is a new tablet because... You did see the other video, unboxing video, just recently, uh, just a couple days ago. So, here is a tablet. So, there it is, brand new in the box. And there's the packaging. Everything's in the package. There's the charge adapter. And there's the booklets, which nobody would be interested in. Uh, there's no SIM tool with this one because it's not supported. So I'm going to take and set this up, and I'm going to do a review on this one if there's any issues with it. And uh, I'm going to be doing another video, so hit the uh, like button and the little bell, and um, please subscribe. And, uh, yeah, so I'll do a review and see if there's any issues with this tablet. I hope there isn't. 
I hope it was just a fluke. I've always had uh, Galaxy or uh, Samsung products. And never ever experienced anything like this. <coughs> so, right on you guys. Thanks for watching.